I want to take that caribou loop from you, right? <laughs> and I think I know you. Okay, if you're on the camera, I can tell you. Come here. But I'm going to tell you why. Uh -oh. My security said I can't take it. I'm going to tell you why, though. I'm going to tell you why, though. When I was in Sydney, Australia some years ago, uh -oh. some motherfucker. So I got to trust her, though. She's the, she's the waitress, right? Okay. Some motherfucker put ketamine in my drink, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? And it had me. Now, keep in mind that Sydney, Australia is the place where the women is like 20 to 1. So I had like seven bad bitches sitting next to me. And I start tripping out on this shit like, uh, this one I had red spiked hair and everything. So I said, I'm gonna go to the bathroom for a minute and start feeling weird, you know what I'm saying? Ketamine, it's like horse tranquilizer, my nigga. We ain't supposed to fucking take that. So I went in the bathroom and one eyeball was up here and the other one was down, down here and shit. And I was like, dude, we gotta go. I told my dude, we gotta go. So I get in the van, <laughs> I get in the minivan in Sydney, Australia. And the chicks, like, you want us to go with you and take care of you? All seven of them, and I'm like, yeah, okay, come on, come on. They all got in the fucking van, and my dudes, Grant Rice and everybody that was with us happened to be, we was there with Young Mop and Corrupt, and you know, the loonies was all down there, you know what I'm saying? So they, they found a dude, <laughs> they found a dude who did it somehow, and they beat him up, pop, 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 while we were in the van with the girls. So everybody jumped in the van, like, let's go. So the dude who they beat up took a brick, and I was so high, the brick came and said, and broke the window all out of the minivan, whoever was driving it. It didn't hit me or nothing, because I was high as fuck. So we got to the hotel, and I started feeling like real, like, I'm like, okay, I'm about to die in this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing shows down here. This is my first time in Sydney. So we got in front of the hotel, and these badass bitches was with me. You know what I'm saying? Like seven of them said they want to take care of me. They say it's 20 or more, but it's seven bitches. I'm good. You know what I mean? So I get out of the car. We're in this big ass five star hotel because you go over there and try to do a bid for you and shit. I ran out of the motherfucking minivan, away from the bitches, up the goddamn uh, escalator. Chris Calico was going that way, and I yelled out to him, like, Chris! Like, help me. And he's like, nah, nigga. It was basically like, whatever, nigga, you know what I'm saying? So I went up the escalator, and the elevator was that way. So I ran down that way, and I'm pushing the elevator like this, and I can see the bitches coming. I'm like, I don't want these bitches with me. Fuck that, fuck that, fuck that, fuck that. Why would Scorpio take on me running from bad bitches? You know what I'm saying? This is not the drug for me, you feel me? So I'm pushing the thing, I get on, and I leave the bitches. I go all the way up to my room. I'm in my room, dude, and I only even watch sports and shit, but like Tim Duncan and Stephon Mulberry was playing or something against each other or something, and <laughs> their faces were turning into panda bears and shit, and their face and panda I'm like, this is fucked up, you know what I mean? So that's why I can't take nobody's drink.